Isn't it called the Gandhi effect? No. <laughs> no, it's a... Uh, oh, God, why am I blanking on his name? In prison? Because he was... He's wrong? The, he's Googling the Gandhi effect. <laughs> Mandela. Oh. Nelson Mandela. Gandhi. You ignorant skink. Welcome, horrible people, to the Horrible Opinions Podcast. As always, I'm your horrible host that probably needed some ganja or hash to get through this movie, Kenny. Did, did Daniel just did Daniel just die? I don't know what noise he was trying to make, but if it was simulated like a fly buzzing around my head, that's what it sounded like on my end. No, Discord didn't pick it all up, but I was doing the thing where he he, he breathed that he breathed out for like three minutes while he was dying, and then he just went. Eh. That's annoying, people. Just die. I'm the baby in the crib watching Mama get railed, and then she gets eaten, and then he just bounces. Ryan, so cute. <laughs> Bye-bye. Yes. What are we watching? And of course, of course, I already almost said the name by saying almost the name of the movie it was remade from. We are watching a Spike Lee joint, The Sweet Blood, <laughs> yeah, The Sweet Blood of Jesus. Written by Tommy Wiseau, filmed by committee, acted by... I don't know. Crab people? What would you say? Crab people. Crab people. I don't know. I'm interrupting you. I'm sorry. Days. What, what's the name of this movie? I said it. You didn't. I did. I did. I said the sweet blood of Jesus. It's okay, the sweet blood it. of Jesus. Uh, yeah. Let the record show when you go back and listen to this. Uh, you'll see or hear rather that I said it twice. I'll fucking now. edit your first one out. I'll edit your dick out. <laughs> you know what this movie didn't have? Editing. Editing. <laughs> Pacing. I read reviews for this, and, um, what? Um, <laughs> look, the, what did they the see review, that you did not? I oh, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Here. wait, wait, slow down. Slow down. Yeah, 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 slow Everyone, it slow down. down. Yeah, for sure. Daniel. Yeah, yeah, yeah I want to yeah, be yeah, here yeah. longer. What's that sweet, sweet <laughs> body of Christ synopsis, Daniel? Oh, Jesus There's Christ. The a rock. dagger Amen. that if you get stabbed by it, you, you, you hunger for the, the blood, and, um, so, uh, for... A doctor, professor, man. I don't. What was his job? How did he have money? I don't remember. His parents died. They were rich, yeah. right? But he's like a big time professor or something. Yeah, he's written like many books. Money from your okay. tax dollars. And that white lady, she liked the books, but she didn't agree with the message of the books. So it's like you know, cradle of life, dog. I don't know what you don't agree about with that, but whatever. I once saw Swan Lake. Okay. And as I'm watching Swan Lake in this theater, my seats are bolted to the floor, 90 degree angle to the stage, meaning the stage is directly at my left, but I'm staring into the middle of the theater. Did that help your experience? I would Wait, say, what? I, I blacked my, out while you were talking, my, my much like I blacked out during this movie. Is that Swan Lake, so Swan Lake. boring. Oh. However, pretzel man dancing for the first three minutes of this movie, best thing I've seen. If only movie, it easily. wasn't to just random music that they just acquired off a of SoundCloud. Okay, I was worried, Daniel. As I've I've watched this five times. No, you I, have not. Shut up. I have. I have. You know, there is no way. Yeah, there wasn't enough time. I w <laughs> you don't have three hundred hours. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Hours. I'm sorry. Not the movie. I've oh, watched the dancing? That dancing five okay, times. Yeah, yeah, not yeah. the movie. No, the movie I've watched once, oh. and that. Was it over the course of two days? That's already telling. But over the course of two days, when he goes up I had to take a like break. The red brick wall. I've seen that red brick wall. They dances up against. I've seen that in like a couple music videos. So that must be a popular wall. It's a good wall. Look, my notes on that scene yeah. are the fuck that bendy dude doing because he like unbends out of the middle of the basketball court, and then I'm like, oh shit, get it, dude. And that was the that was the last time I was happy. I was worried that this dance was an interpretation of what was going to happen in this movie, and I just didn't get it. And so I think I was right. 
that's my fear with this entire movie is that I just didn't get it. <laughs> no, this is one of those movies where people pretend to get something that isn't there. I, it's there. What, what's there? It's, it's, it's not. It's, it's, a, it's, so, it's a metaphor for addiction or whatever. No, that's what you get. All the surface level, like it's very. I only clear know that because I read get. reviews of the original. <laughs> right. Very. It's very clear. Addiction is one of the things. I thought they were just weird vampires. Oh yeah. yeah okay. So uh, back to my synopsis. It, uh, the uh, the dagger he gets stabbed by it and you turn into vamp you turn into boring uh bourgeois vampires the ashanti dagger was much <laughs> cooler in the golden child did that if you if any but that turn into Dra- draculas i don't know they only use it to kill a demon so i imagine if they stab someone with it it would turn them into some sort of dracula look all i'm saying is kill yourself at your house don't come over to my house Daniel. In my tree. Put down your forty-five, Daniel. Put down your AK-47. I like that. Everything in the church, nukes. I like. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Well, more yeah, church. Put down them gun stocks. You can't hug your kids' with nuclear arms. And then I was like, that guy back there, he ain't participating. What's up with him? But I was like, I love Mr. Bowtie. He's gonna, you know, be <laughs> Mr. around Bowtie? for a while. Was that Mr. Hightower? Yeah. Yeah, they pull out the Shanti dagger and that little case on it made it look like it was some weird testicle platter. Like, I thought those... It's all about the crops. He shuts the door just for the guy to be like, I think I'll take a walk outside. I just shut the door! Yeah, but did you know the Ashanti invented blood transfusions? And right there, I was like, oh, we doing vampires, daddy. <laughs> we do a blood... We do a vampires, daddy. Okay, here's... No one... This movie... The dialogue... No. Well, okay, Daniel. It's the dialogue. So... It. Ugh. I was kind of into it at this stage because I'm like, what? It's it's not. It's like the dance. I'm like, what? Why? I'll tell you why, so Daniel. Like, Art. Because this is a. Sh- well, no, it's a. Because sh- this is basically like a shot for shot remake of the first one, right? And God, all has. the dialogue is the same or something. I don't fucking know, and that's why it's bad. Art is God's ally. Science, his natural foe. Shut up. Who has a passion for soiled underwear or drinking urine? Oh, I did like um, like all the art that's hanging up and stuff. I thought all the art was pretty cool. All of it except for the placement of one. Which one? I don't want some dude staring intensely at the back of my head while I eat dinner. That's a very clear shot of that dude, and he was huge. He was right behind the main <laughs> dude's <laughs> seats at about? the dining room table. The art. It's like this giant painting pic- no, or picture of this dude and he's just staring and he looked big mad right behind where dr hess is eating no thanks the only dude i want in the room hanging on the wall while i'm eating is ronald mcdonald and that's just because I w- he's there to tell me this food is good quality food dude daniel good did you know food, this movie was going to be about vampires before watching it well i had to because i was having a very hard time watching it like getting like actually finding it to watch so yes i did that surprises me like everything's you can get anything you want in china you cannot give them money for this movie really it's kind of weird it's not on also tubi da- it's not on amazon even Prime. though i said it was i even reactivated my canopy account and put in the uh library from our hometown because my university one expired is that a library people said thing? it was on canopy yeah it's a library thing and they have it there so you could get canopy if you went and got a card and yeah, it wasn't there either. But uh, Daniel, what did you think when you seen how how much of that house was window? Did, you, did that trigger anything with you? Were you worried about that house at all? <laughs> no, because uh, so the opening dance gave away that nothing. Uh, this movie had nothing to that. This Give movie us. was going to be boring, and there were going to be no explosions, <laughs> no and that explosions. it was going to be. Uh, uh, lethargic and ponderously paced because you're filling you're filling i don't know why you're filling five minutes at the start of your movie i like the dance i That's just the don't best part i just don't know why it's there look i'm okay with a slow it's, it would be movie, like if he had something shown, has to happen if, it, if, it, <laughs> if the credits had been like uh jurassic park dinosaurs going about their day i like that but why is it here that's all you're getting that you're gonna like like, I still feel like I'm waiting for the movie to happen. <laughs> like, when does Eddie Murphy show up after, like, his stint in Brooklyn? Okay. I'm gonna show you how to do this. We don't walk around being weird. Like, don't drink it off the floor. You gotta drink it off the floor. 
They quit going back to prostitutes. That's how you almost got hey, AIDS the can, first time. Can, can you guys oh, just tell call. me where the wine cellar is? I'm looking for the wine cellar. Why do you got a nice fancy like house, like, uh, like almost like an estate, and yet to go down there I need to use a flashlight? Is that some weird hoity-toity shit where like regular bulbs constantly being on like deteriorate the quality of the wine? So you got to go down there with a well, flashlight? Well, no, there was, like a, there was a spotlight on the wine. Yeah, so, but why she having to use a flashlight to get down there? Couldn't find the light switch? Not her house. But she found a flashlight? And you know what? Yeah, um, not her what house. What was his name? She has no business telling sweet, little, Thank weird you. eyes. Seneschal. Yes. Seneschal. Thank Seneschal. You. I just called him What Rainy. to do. When he she came out, no he said. She had no business telling Mr. Robot how to do his job. Ooh. He came out when they were licking the blood on the floor, and he's like, you guys want some pizza? Because he's just trying anything at this point. That's an Until Dawn reference, Ryan. You might not know that. <laughs> Are we going to have pizza? <laughs> That's what's a pizza. I'm just saying all that glitters ain't gold. And that song was stuck in my <laughs> head for half the movie after he said that. <laughs> And I'm like, are we, are we, it's just like a metaphor for uh, that song, this whole movie? Only shooting stars. That's his favorite spinner song. Oh, God. And then I got an old ass wailing dude in my tree again. Okay, help, help me out. Why? Hit me up. Why is he in the tree? Why How did he, he get up in the tree? Hang himself. Okay, all right, I guess that's true. He's got the noose around his neck. He's ready to hang himself because How did he get up there? his ex-wife is so horrible her ex- just the mere existence of her makes him suicidal. Hey, man, is that why he was going to do Women. that? I mean, she, That's, she just, is a natural bitch. She, she does suck. He's not wrong. He was all cool a few hours before then, though. Yeah, but he's uh, he's drinking. <laughs> is he's he had drinking? A little bit. I had a little drink about an hour ago, and I climbed oh, up God. in your tree. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> That's what this movie needed. If you guys watch sharks. much? I needed sharks <laughs> coming got- out of bathtubs. Coming oh, no. out of the water. If you guys watch much more of this movie, you're going to end up up here with me. You know what? This is not the way you're supposed to wake me up for breakers. That's all I'm saying. Ah! Well, I, I got to say is with those, when they sit down and talk more, the way they're talking. Oh, God. Are you howler monkeying? <laughs> what about the neighborhood? Would you please? He is the only person. He's the only black man in this perfect... neighborhood, okay? Yeah. He does not want to no, answer he... questions from the cops about your dead ass washing up on his property. Yeah. I mean, that's fair. Fair enough. He took the vampirism real quick. Well, what? Okay, so it's Dr. Green, Hess Green, and then his associate is Mr. Hightower, and it's Mr. Hightower who has decided to climb a tree, but he's now fallen out of a tree, and they're having a heart-to-heart. But the next morning, Hightower comes into Hess's room with the Ashanti dagger. No. With well, just an axe first. With an axe, yeah. The, and he's the dagger's on the bedside, because you gotta sleep with some sort of a bladed weapon at your side just in case. Uh, don't you? I, I've got, yeah, I've got I've got one of your katanas next to me, just of course in you do. case. I have, a, I have a critique. Oh, you do? <laughs> <laughs> before he comes in there and asks him a question, that night before, when they're sitting there and they're talking to each other, I want you to think about that dialogue they're having with each other, because if you close your eyes... Yeah. The way that both of them are talking, the pacing of their speech, the words they're using, everything, it sounds like the same character talking to themselves. Like, it sounds like a monologue. You're right. Not a, not a discussion between two people. It's the That's the duality of man. That was horrible. We've solved it. We don't know. It's a shining moment. There is no Mr. Hightower. No, the whole is. thing's just... This Hess? <laughs> no, he, not until he's a frozen pop in the basement. Oh, where's um, Pop? He's frozen. Schrodinger's frozen ex-husband. He doesn't exist until you open the lid. It just mm-hmm. it felt so f- forced the way they were talking. And I get like yeah, that's the this parties. entire movie. Yeah, yeah. Well, I get the party scene. You know, later where everyone's talking to each other in a manner you're trying to put on airs for like a massive group. But God, you're just two dudes sitting there talking about you know bitches. But putting on airs. You're killing me. And then in the morning, you're literally killing me. But after I've stabbed you with the Ashanti dagger, I strip down, I get into your bathtub, and I brush nice my teeth. Bro. That's teeth. where I brush my teeth. That's pretty efficient. I thought he was going to like OD on toothpaste or something. I Can thought he was going to slit his wrist. Instead, what he does I, is find a gun. Where do you get the gun? Out of a hat. And then he shoots himself. From church. 
preacher was saying, lay down your guns, and he so went when, in and when, he collected them. <laughs> when the preacher was saying these things, what it didn't show was him throwing them into the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> But down your guns. Now, what it did show us after he brushed his teeth in the bathtub, because you want to die of fresh breath, is Wang Doodle. Yeah. Yeah. I was more and looking I'll... at his bum. I'm like, hmm, you squat. It was, a nice, it was a nice butt. I'm like, geez. Yeah. I was not expecting that. Looking back in previous movies, I feel like the majority of the movies that we are actually getting dick in are bad. They just aren't good movies. They're not, they're not good movies. It's like uh, the audience our needs fault, something. Daniel. This movie sucks. We need something to latch on to. It needed is that what something you're to grab onto yeah yeah let's finally this is for the 3d version are you telling me that after dr green wakes up from the gunshot finds the body on the floor and immediately becomes the liquor from resident evil 2 you did not just scream like a little girl going no no this is not okay no there was there was no hesitation there was no moral like uh, uh, he just like went right to it so the only takeaway i have from that is he already knew what the Ashanti did. No, would he do. would have done that before. He was a little blood freak. He, he was into blood play Here's, before okay. he even became a vampire. No, he. I think he was actually into scat play, and then he switched <laughs> it to blood play after the knife. When you wake up as a vampire, when you wake up, if you know, I'm gonna be, know, I'm gonna you're... be a vampire next to you. <laughs> if your and sire out, isn't there, and you're gonna be if tired your sire of me, to feed if you, your sire isn't there to feed you. Wake you up food. really hungry. And you wake up hungry next to me. We'll play VT. I'll, I'll, I'll role play you through it. <laughs> All right. And I said, sire, I'm going <laughs> to drink that four blood. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, no, bubby. <laughs> and I said, sire, I'm going to get this prostitute that walks like a man. You hold on. I want you to go to the blood bank first. And I said, sire, I'm going to rob this blood bank with the best loop on the third scheme I can Lupin think of. The Set fire to the trash. <laughs> I'm just saying he 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 takes to this. See, there's parts Real where easy. the movie just like it moves quickly because we go from on the floor licking it up to immediately blood bank, like no in between where he's stealing blood. So like that part, we're moving really fast. And then we'll just have a classy party where nothing is really happening until until it's time to go to the basement fridge. You get a Capri Sun is how I should have drank it. Yeah. Now, how much now, vodka do you like in your blood? Oh, God. My blood is like 90% vodka. Duh. So between th between there and there, I've got some notes. Okay. Okay. First off, I was wondering at some point if he was already one of those vampires before the guy stabbed him, but then we see how long it takes for someone else to change later. So I'm going to say, okay, no, he wasn't. Second note, the ocean is like the womb. Felt like someone was going to say that. <laughs> I don't think they did, but it, it, it could have been. Uh, you're right, Mr. Though. Long is actually my father's name. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Wouldn't his first name need to be Long and the that's, last name that's Dick? That's two on the nose, He's Daniel. not fucking James Bond. That's the name, two on the, the nose. The name's Dick. Long Dick. Yeah, he fucked it up. He thought he was going to go take some standardized tests or something. Um, and I said, the fuck... And then, is it that easy to pick a lock? You just shove some tiny scissors into the lock and jiggle it a bit? Yeah. Yeah, he's got uh, now, vampire lock picking abilities now. Oh, he took that feat. Plus yeah. two decks, bro. And now I'm at the party, and I say, I hate how these ladies talk, too. And They're... then, okay. Buck Bucky fucking Dent. Why? Oh, that's why that's what? there. <laughs> I'm like, look at my note. Why do I have Bucky what? fucking Dent in there? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what was the other name? So the there's four dudes... It's no, the two there's standing across. Got, no, respe is no this... response to Bill Buckner or Bucker. Yeah, Bill, Billy Buckner, Billy Buckner. What the Buckner. fuck is happening with these dudes? I don't They're know. Too pretentious for us. I think so. The two white women who are having a conversation somehow about morality and crime, sin, forgiveness. I think that's supposed to be the message of this movie. Nope, doesn't work. But I don't understand it. All I understood was someone at some point said, I had the strangest thing happen to me this morning. Nah, this afternoon. Yeah. I'm tripping! <laughs> disco, I'm just tripping disco. balls! Where's my disco, blood? Disco, disco. I mean, my beet juice. Get that shaky hands. Look. You get, this is where Rami Malek shows up. No We're licky, no sticky. That, but it, no licky, no but sticky. Like, yeah, why do, you, why do you dump it into a glass and go walk around with it? People, intelligent people are going to be like, that looks kind of like blood. It's a bit and viscous. Then even when you, 
you put it in your mouth and you're like, yes, he should have just popped a straw on that bitch and crushed it like a Capri Sun. Or just drink it in the basement in shame? Yeah, and said, oh, it's organic. I would have just said it's kombucha. People don't like, well, some people like that shit. That shit's gross. Like, you drink it, spit it out, like, nah, it's kombucha. I mean, you wouldn't it's understand. a party with all these white people. <laughs> you could have just done it, and they'd be like, oh, this is a thing black people do, I guess. I guess. And then that lady got his drink turned into a Bloody Mary, and she oh. ruined it. It's probably yeah. the black pepper. Probably. I'm no uh, white lady expert. I'm no, I, I'm no expert of anything. <laughs> You're right. I'll just stop. <laughs> but you have made observations. What's your observation, Daniel? I hate everybody in this movie. Seneschal? He's got Almost. weird eyes. <laughs> that's, but that's him. The, that's not his character. The Daniel. baby? The baby? Expressive. Oh, my. Oh, we, we'll get there. Let's just talk about prostitute number one first. Okay, first off, don't ever take me into one of those red rooms or green rooms or anything like that. I want regular lights and a bar. in my rooms. Yes. Yeah, I feel like you either want, like, super dim lights or it needs to be... You know what? You know what he needed to go to? He, he needed, needed to go to a better lit place. Oh, <laughs> that's it, what he walked out with. He needed to go to that goth club that Blade killed all those goth people in. I thought you were... For some reason, I thought you were going to say that weird goth club that, like, uh, Middle Ditch went to and had, like, part of their weird Hollywood sex cult thing, but to each their own. Okay. That's, I'm just saying that's the, fine. the red lights made me uncomfortable, like like not like emotionally uncomfortable. Like uh, it I, bought, I it asked made, quite, made is this crawl. how this character talked in the original? I haven't seen the original. Now, Gondra and Hess, you can find Dale. Yeah, I bet I could. Should have watched that. I think it was right there on Tubi no, I or Canopy. I seen it. I seen yeah. it. I saw it there. I would say go watch that, but after watching this, I don't want to watch anything even related. I to think it. I'd be more forgiving of that. Since it's like 50 years old. I just, on my long, slow journeys, I like to go somewhere. Okay. Help us out. You, you're you both worldly men, men of culture. Oh, yeah, sure. I've gone outside a time or two. What are your lines for picking up a prostitute? I have money. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. I'd say, hey, hop on it. <laughs> is this flirting? The, the, is what I is my, around is, this? Is my, is my dick. I'm Dick Long's the name. Richard to my friends. You guys hear that song, though, that was playing in the background? No. Go, Look, go for it. Looking at my coochie, it's about that time. Oh, my God, the music in this. He was, like, afraid. <laughs> He's, like, afraid to have any moment without music. Because dead because air. There's, <laughs> if there's dead air, they'll notice how boring this is. Instead, we'll put bad music over the entire movie. So maybe they'll complain about that instead of how boring the movie is. Ryan, put some a light bass track underneath this entire episode, please. Go, go for it. <laughs> go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Looking at my coochie, it's about that time. What I'm did, like, is he gonna eat her? I, I, and then like he just slices her throat real fast. No, he corkscrews. He, he bites her first, right? And she's like, no, well, he's like, no teething. Boob. Yeah, yeah, don't bite the boob, no. And then yeah, I'll he do takes, what I he, want. He takes a corkscrew to the back. Fair. And then he pulls it out after he chokes her out. And then he's, he slits her fucking throat. Ugh. And then it's bleeding everywhere. And my first thought was, I don't think you can drink all that at I once. You really should have brought the, a Tupperware. The, the blood splurt was good. Yeah. This movie has one positive and this is it. I think and it just oh, happened. I yeah, her, her every positive time HIV on screen status. Kill, it's pretty good. I mean, did you guys go right to HIV or AIDS? I wasn't sure yeah, why when he was he... pissed when he looked at I I assumed it was HIV or AIDS in the pill bottle. Really? So that wouldn't Yeah. yeah. How did you make that, that, that con- I've have... been here too long. How did you make that connection? Cuz if you're HIV positive, you're taking meds to like control it, right? Yes. I mean, yeah, that's what's so happening. That's what but... I that's what I assumed then. Oh. It's just it's more it's more the negative connotation with sex so, cuz I I thought about like blood cuz he spits the blood out and he didn't like it. So it's right. like why I, wouldn't I... he like the blood? Oh, there's something yeah. wrong with the blood. What's a blood disease? That's a blood disease. Sickle cell anemia. Wow. I thought it was like she was just taking some kind of drugs and it tainted it and she didn't like the drug aspect of it. Man, not oh, that. I guess that could have been it too, but it was but after no, he like, looked at no, the you pills. You two are absolutely right because we because he goes to a HIV testing clinic and I'm like, huh, okay. Is there a thing? Before, but oh, before shit. he been does the, that. Oh, would shit. Would that have been the same in the she original? She comes back to life. She breathing. But you if she just a ghoul? 
You killed it me. You killed it oh, me. I was dying. And then she starts to hit him with her wig. And I'm like, it was a wig the whole time. So well, many of course lines. it was a wig the whole wig. time, Ryan. I didn't know. Yeah, looked, that's her, that's her prostitute good. uniform. Oh. And right here, though, I'm thinking, you know what? You know what's a good movie about people who don't die and they're all like miserable about it and stuff like Thirst. that? But it's, but it's a good movie. Well, Thirst is good, too. I was going to say He Never Died with Henry Rollins. Never seen it. Never even heard of it. You could have just made it up for all I know. Oh, I make up things lots of times. That's a good movie. He didn't have AIDS in that. What did he have? Problems with Jesus. Sadness. On a personal level. Oh, on a personal level. Like you knew the dude? Hey, we all know him a little bit. He had me put down my guns. Well, no, the preacher man had you. And then that Mr. Hightower took it and he shot himself. So he took it and he shot himself. Look. So where, what did he do with her? Did he just leave her there to be like That's, a ghoul? Yeah. I didn't understand that here, because we never see her again. She's just left on her own. But here's what ha- off screen. Here's what's happening. She's eating other people because that's or so she's now killed a herself. Zombie pand- like epidemic. Because yeah, so you you kill them and then like I guess twelve hours later or something like that, maybe a day later, you wake up and you're now a vampire. And then you say you killed it me. Did you like when she said you killed it me, Daniel? I did laugh, but again, this is <laughs> me, me asking, did this character talk like this in the original? Because I, I don't know. <laughs> I told someone, I think on <clears throat> Twitter before we watched this, that with Spike Lee, for me, whether you like the movie or not, you get a feel for, uh, like, he has an idea and he's very, very feels like Spike Lee. And this feels like Spike Lee, but this isn't a Spike Lee I enjoy. And when it's a Spike Lee I don't enjoy, it's... I like the character names and the, the fashion. The dancing was great. The kills were great. He's got good character names. What was uh, what was the... the well, H- Henishal? That's a good was, name. Henishal. He doesn't get to take credit for those in this. No, he changed them. He changed some minor roles, I, I guess is what I read. Yeah, in the original, the guy's name is like Dilbert or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it's Seneschal Higginbottom. Higginbottom, yes! Uh, He's British! Lafayette Hightower, Bishop Z, Ganja Hightower, and Dr. Hess Green. You should have changed Ganja. I don't like that one. I like Ganja. But then it wouldn't have been Ganja and Hess. But, but it's not Ganja and Hess, so you could change it. But it really is. How many really times is. have you gotten a call about someone complaining that they're outside freezing their British tits off? At least once a week. That's just my I thought that she outside. was the best actor in this. No, the baby did a damn good job. The baby did a good job being cute. I guess. And, and did, Raimi oh, did you see that haunting, was a great shawl. That haunting expression the baby had as he watched yeah, his Raimi mother get railed? Yeah, but Raimi ain't got anything to do. And he carries it. Carries it. No, it was the dancer. He was the best. I have a note. Someone had a great smile. And we never go to funky hotels in Amsterdam. A damn smile. And... What? Oh yeah, that was that was uh, her husband. That's how she fell for oh, him. Oh, high tower had a and then damn good smile. You like when people just show up in your house and just start smoking? Yeah, especially when they're just showing up to hang out until their ex husband shows up so they can scream at them for money. I guess we all have been there. And I'm just, <laughs> Some of point... us more than others. I bet. yeah. He said, <laughs> uh, "What would you have done if I had not been here when you called?" I don't think about the what could have been. I could have been born with a dick. She called his cell phone. Lafayette's cell phone. Why does he have Lafayette's cell phone? I don't think it was Lafayette's cell phone. But how would she have his? But number? he's walking on the beach when she when 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 she calls. Okay. It's a really long cord, Daniel. He's rich. No, no, Daniel. That's not the point. You get a you get a call from an unknown number. I I've never answered those. Never. Okay, I what seldom is this supposed those. to It doesn't matter. It doesn't Every matter. Every year. It doesn't matter. At this point, I was thinking about one of my favorite songs from a movie that Which we watched one? together. Yeah. It goes a little bit like this. Bored in the house, and I'm in the house bored. <laughs> bored. <laughs> so I'm in the house bored. That is he's the most... That... Wait, no, he's... that's the other weird, bu- weird eye guy. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, and then I've got another confession to make. Uh-huh. I killed a dude. I want to kill somebody. And she's like, I hope it was my ex-husband. Your husband suicided. It wasn't. I didn't kill him. I killed somebody. Your husband suicided. Let's bang. Eh? Like, Eh? first off, yeah, Dr. Green can't handle his shit. Smokes one joint and he's confessing to murder his prostitutes. That's the most stressful uh, uh, dope smoking I've ever seen put to Phil. Yeah. He was looking at that joint like it was crystal meth. (laughs) 
<laughs> guess what, guys? Ganja's over there, like, secretly laughing because it was just a clove cigarette. Oh. She rolled it herself. She rolled it herself. Why are all the rich men bonkers? Daniel, at this point, my note does say, what the fuck is happening with this music? Well, they had to do something to distract from the fact that right after they did Big Smoochin, they did an E.T. moment where they, they did. <laughs> they did. Fuck? Your, your <laughs> but then they didn't even like turn it into like a heart. I can't do no, it. But didn't. you know, they look, didn't look. They called me. And then you know, the dude. They called me. The Hess, dude came in his No pants. foreplay green. Yeah, okay? he did. <laughs> he did. He had to go clean up. I've never met a green that didn't just jizz in their pants. A what? A green. A green? Oh, fair enough. Yeah. Oh yeah, every green I've met. Oh, pants I understand. Stains right down I the understand. left side of the leg. Okay, Daniel, you can live forever, but you will always prematurely ejaculate. That's the catch. <laughs> What's okay? So all I'm gain. So the only difference is that I'm living forever. <laughs> oh, yeah. well, I guess oh. so. Oh, Buddy. well, it's only premature for the other two. person. For you, right on time. It's right on, right, right on, on schedule. The train's movie had always a... come at nine. <laughs> <laughs> this movie had a chance to do the best thing and ever. So the funniest do I. Thing what? Ever. What's that? Movie had a chance to do the funniest thing ever. If he uh, if he came back for round two, yeah, and it just it just happened again. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's a different movie because she just leaves. Well, look, I don't think she does. There's some there's no, some it juicy it red fruit again, eating. Just... Yeah, she says, "I'm going to town, and I love you." Is it she who goes to town, yeah. or is it he goes to town? He goes to town. The two pump chump. Hess goes to town. He goes to pick up. Now he's going to pick up single mom prostitute. Yeah. Well, first off, though. Ganja Super keeps bitch. complaining about her husband not having money. That's all she keeps bringing up. And Dr. Green is like, what do you want? I was like, dude, I think she's made it pretty clear. It's money. And you have it. So you're gold. And then he's leaving. He's going to go to town. He's got to go do the thing. And he's like, don't worry. Uh, Ramey will take care of you. And she's like, well, be back. Dinner will be ready at nine. And I say, who eats dinner at nine? The I French. do on accident. They do it on purpose at nine? Yeah, nine ten. That's around the time I'm like getting out of bed for my first uh, banana bread break. Oh, may we? Come on, a banana bread. <laughs> Come on, a banana bread. Take the banana bread straight to my heart. Now I put the crumbs in my bed, and it's is this? Oh, go ahead. What about the crumbs? The right. I didn't have a rhyme. If there had been a rhyme, it would have been good, but... There were crumbs in my bed, in and they fell out of my head, because I got up out of bed, and they're in my butt. <laughs> uh, I'm doing, like, he loves her already, jazz though. hand movements with my hand. You can't see. That's what's making Daniel laugh. I, yeah, that's definitely what you're doing. I'm doing the dance from the beginning of the movie. I've got all the steps down. Uh, okay. You know what? Proud of you. Okay. I'm not that bendy. What? Is this movie trying to say something that our Don't vampire... That baby is on, as far as we see he's only going after black prostitutes um it's a victimless crime what do they call that they call that the uh like the less missing mm -hmm. the police don't look as hard for them the already missing well they're not already missing he makes them well I, well he actually they don't go i guess they're not he's finished. they're not missing at all right because mama's gonna wake right, back up but nobody will ever miss them so they're already missing, except for that baby. No, the that people in their them. lives will miss them, you know, that baby. No, they're, they're clients. They're, uh, they're, uh, they're pimp. <laughs> hey, Daniel, red wine now. Mm. Red wine now, red Daniel. Wine now. <laughs> red wine okay, now. Okay, well, there's, there's wine in the cellar. Red wine now. We're, th we're the cellar. Okay. Go downstairs. You find Maybe. stairs that go down, that's probably the cellar. Maybe I don't get enough prostitutes, but, like, <laughs> Did you guys think that lady with the baby was a prostitute at the beginning no, of the conversation? Uh, no, because it's a metaphor for a junkie. She's like a recovering junkie, and he uh, drags her back into it. Okay, what what about her sitting on the bench playing with her sweet baby made you think she was a recovering junkie? Well, the, Maybe I don't do enough that drugs. Happens, everything that happens after that. Okay, so how did he spot her? Oh, though? he can smell after, it. He's got the predator senses He now. can smell it. He sees the heat vision. He's, he, he does that I'm, weird noise that they make the... Oh, no. Well, I'm just like, okay, is he is he going to talk to this lady because he wants to eat that baby like it's a portable warm Capri Sun I, or something? I <laughs> thought they both were going to be chewed on, and I'm like, yeah. I, I'm not going to... I might have turned this off if he had eaten that baby. You know what? I've, if he had eaten that baby, into it. better movie. I've been mad. I've oh, been big mad, I've but I've been watching pissed. it. Pissed. Like the fucking like, beginning of Steakland? Ooh. 
But then he, uh, he's like, why do you, why would you tell a stranger where you live and don't do your business where you live? And then I'm like, this dude is forward as fuck. And I was like, wait, did he spot a mom prostitute? I'm like, the fuck? And then we cut back to, uh, I think we cut back to the house now where Ganja and Seneschal are getting back. And I'm so mad right now. I'm more mad at this than I would have been if he ate the baby. Open my she door, makes... Seneschal. Well, he's Take getting my the hand, at... Seneschal. Oh my god. Yeah, don't, Carry don't me hold up your the threshold, Seneschal. Shuts the door in his face. Oh, she would have been dead. You are a guest in this house, lady. No, no. She's, yes. she's had sex with the owner of the house. Now it's her house. Who hasn't? She's rubbed her balls <laughs> in it. <laughs> it's hers now. Oh, what? I was like, stand up for yourself, King, when he raised his voice at her. But then, you know, also for some reason in my head, I just thought he was going to be in the new Highlander movie, and I think he should. Is he not? Because for he some Richie? reason, now now that you say it in my head, I feel like it that's feel, true. It feels right, you right? You know what it is? It's because he played the, the guy from Queen, right? That's probably that's, what it oh, is. Oh, okay. Freddie Mercury? Yeah. Is that the guy? That sounds right. That's, that's, the, that's, that's the, the, one. the lead singer. Was. Yep, that's one of the guys. You know, you know how he died? AIDS. AIDS. No. Oh, he got bit HIV. by a vampire. And go- oh. oh. He got ganjed. <laughs> I hate when I get ganjed. I'd say where's he got the, hessed. Where's the wine cellar, Daniel? Can you give me like, any idea <laughs> of what direction now. to go? <laughs> Down the stairs. Hmm. Well, if you're looking for wine, do you open the freezer? No. Uh, well. Unless, I'm, unless I made like wine uh, popsicles. I think now she's that? just snooping, right? She found the wine, but the... The refrigerator, no, the freezer just happens to be nearby. Well, she's looking for those little popsicle things that you drink in the summer. You know the ones. Oh, I know the ones. The sl- the, the the wine slushy bags or whatever. Sure. What yeah, does she find? I'm just saying, uh, a freeze pop. Hi, the frozen high tower. Frozen high tower. You pop them in the microwave for two and a half minutes. They come right back to life. You wrap them in a wet paper towel. Have to. Have to. It... You don't start snooping after you've committed to the long-term relationship. You snoop before. These people... They've had sex once. What order. commitment do you see? He said he loved her. That's just... And she. Uh, she's she already treating his manservant like her manservant. Yeah. Look. Well, remember their the houses scene? are joined. Okay. We've seen Gremlins. And I think this yeah. dinner scene is the homage, the best homage to Gremlins they could come up with, with the Ganja has to take care of Ganja speech. Okay, well... Did you, did you get that vibe, yes. or is it only me? I, I see that now, but before we got there, though, we have to cut back to, don't eat that baby. He didn't. He said goodbye. He said goodbye, sweet. I was like, oh, so cute. So cute. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. And then we it's cut so out, cute. and we see, like, more, like, dead mommy over there, like, boobs hanging out. There's a lot of boobs in this movie, too. Spike yeah. was all about them. And, and you realize, and... whatever he did, he did in front of the baby. Yeah. Yeah. And nobody's gonna come check on that baby. Might as well eat it. Well, no, the mom's going to be back up in 12 hours. In 12, maybe 24 oh, that's, hours. That's baby's true. Probably and then she's going to okay. eat the baby. But how much is she going to eat? Because I think he just got there like within the tw- within 12 hours. If, he, if we had come up 24 hours later, that baby's arms then would have been moving. They weren't moving when he goes does the revisit because baby's dead. But I think the baby's going to come back to life. It'd be super pissed. Ah, I'm a, that'd be one pissed baby. Now, yeah, they get back home. He gets back home for their dinner at 9 p.m. It's awfully bright out for a 9 p.m. dinner. Well, it's uh, okay. Let's think about uh, the East Coast and the sun during the summertime and the time that the sun would set. Do you think? Would be. Do you think they just confused a six for a nine? We've all been there. That's why I they're try, so often I accidentally, together. I accidentally do 96s and all the time. All the time. So now we're back for our awkward dinner. We get her story time. We talk about her young brother, baby Jesus. And I was like, hmm, okay. Is I'm going to be honest, just... this is about where I stopped paying attention. <gasps> oh, baby whenever Jesus? she said I was, I was beating his ass and my other siblings were watching. I was, and then he I was tabbing me through in the various stomach. articles. I was reading about elephants. Uh, I think I looked at some pictures of some wombats. Like um, I saw a lady like washing a wombat, you know, a lot of wombat related activities. And you know what? I was happier. I just I don't know what we were supposed to get out of the story there. It seemed all kinds of bad. <laughs> she beat the, she was beating the shit out of her brother. Well, they, were, they were punched both... her in the stomach. Yes. <gasps> and then dad beat the shit out of him because he's no, not supposed to punch not, a lady. Not dad. Mommy. Oh, mommy. 
But, like, what, what was he supposed to do? Sit there and get his ass kicked? Because it sounded like she was tearing into him for years of uh, teasing her. And then when her dad comes to her room later and says, you know, life's going to be tough because you're a woman. You're a woman. You got you to gotta stand up for yourself. That's like no one she else was. will. She was beating his ass. And her, so I guess she took that to heart by being a gold digger who yeah, does nothing do for herself. She, I'm not sure what she did. Did we ever find out, like, employment-wise, what she was about? Oh, marrying people. But Hightower didn't have money. It didn't seem and like it. And she didn't realize that until after she married him, and that's why she was pissed. Turns out they'd only been married for a week. It took one week, and Hightower already one week. went to Bellevue, came out six months later. Time works as a fabric. What, okay, what do we got? We got Look, I what? drank your dead husband's blood. Yeah. I ain't a freak. Oh, yeah, Ganja? Well, you're addicted to money and nicotine. That's as bad as blood, dog. And I'm like, no. You're yeah, you're right. It's not as bad. It's not as bad. But she's like, oh, uh, we ain't going to keep uh, him in the freezer anymore, though. That's where I put, like, you know, my stuff and whatnot. That's where I put so let's my go... popsicles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so let's let's go throw him in the goldfish pond. Now, as I drag him out there, you know, <laughs> d- don't be coy. As I, as I drag oh, him out there nice. and they chuck him off the dock, there's a nice gurgle sound at the end when he's sinking. And it is perfect. It's like a... And I'm like, oh, yeah. And then I didn't think it was going to sink. I was hoping it was just going to float on the top the entire time (laughs) as they walk away. They're like, oh, how long are we supposed to like character? The actor's going, oh, shit, it's not sinking. It's supposed to sink. How long are we supposed to watch it not sink before (laughs) they yell? Spike, it's not. Spike, yell, cut, cut, yell, cut, Spike. It's not sinking, Spike. Yell, cut. Quit quit having the shot on it. Maybe we just turn our back and walk away and he'll yell. Nope, he hasn't. Okay, shit. Did it sink? I can't see it. Now they're forever bonded. Like, we'll just add a gurgling noise so that'll be fine. Marriage. Uh, we're going to get marriage. Mother. And, like, kiss her dude. <laughs> and then, like, they're the only ones at the beach. The no. wedding finishes. And Shinishal well, is the... there to clap. Well, I mean, yeah, like, the, his you know, clap was Shinishal very funny. and the priest. And I was like, yeah, he claps. It's hilarious. Please, please clap. Then, Everyone, please clap. Now, they start walking back from the beach and that, their crappy music's playing. I thought the Walk of Life should have been playing because I thought the movie was ending. I was like, I felt like I'd been here for a long time. I was like, this is how they're ending it. This movie like, is this the is hyperbolic it. time chamber. It is. Time it is didn't what end. is time? It didn't end. I pulled it up, and there was still like an hour left. And I'm like, how? And you could see Seneschal behind them struggling to carry a big umbrella. Yeah, big old umbrella. Isn't that funny? That's but then, funny. Okay, so then, then he stabs her with the knife. And that's why I'm getting like, okay, wait, hold on. So those other people just ghouls? Because they were changing without knife stab. That's... Yeah, I don't... But he looked so relieved when she woke when she up. When she woke up? Yeah, because he's like, like oh, thank God you're awake. But I'm going to go Yeah, b- but then she's sitting now, there... Though. Well, she can't breathe. She's, like, freaking out, and he, like, gets down there tries to do some smooching. And I'm like, no. And then he just walked away while she's struggling. And then he also... He didn't tell her he was going to change her. That's a dick move. I thought he did. I thought they talked about it. Uh, she didn't really believe him, though. Yeah, but she, he just said it. Or and she then, thought yeah, she could still... fix him, you know? One of those... I can fix you. I and can then she fix sta- you. He stabs her two more times at the tree. And oh, he's yeah, like, I got hand. you. I got your ass. But this time there's no penetration. And there's, yeah, and there's still 45 oh, minutes moves left. over. And I like Raimi's purple pants he's wearing in this next scene. Fashion game's on point. It's pretty good. I, 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 my note is, okay, okay, okay. No more gagging up the blood, please. No more gagging up the blood. I quit, can't take quit, it. Quit crying, lady. We're going to have guests. You know, we're going to go be guests. Well, no, she's hungry all the time now. We, same. She's been a vampire for two minutes. Same. <laughs> Look. But different. Being crushed under the weight of immortality. You don't know the amount of ages You guys have been immortal for through. like a day. He's had a good life of immortality. He's lived a lot of extra years. You haven't years. done anything. Also, He's gone also, through the ages. There's no TV in this house. It's not a good house. I could have told you that. There's that a, right there is all you need to know. There's and a record you can't player. find the wine cellar. And I keep getting lost trying to find the goddamn wine cellar. These ladies are weird. Can I introduce His you to my childhood friend? Ta- is it Tangia? I think it's Sa- Tangia. Sahara? What, what fucking Sahara? No, Sahara was the single mom. Yeah, Sahara oh. was single mom. I think it's Tangia. And they're like... Tangier. Tangier. Okay, before, we, before we induct you into our society of the eternal floor licking, do you like to dance? Do you like to get your face about six inches away from my face while we hold an awkward conversation. Oh, my God. And, and we occasionally touch, like, each other on their shoulders. And, well, I'm black Irish. There you go. Is she, like, vampire yeah, my mesmerizing mom's black her? black and my dad's Irish. Black Irish. There you go. 
Yeah, then my next note during this conversation was, I don't enjoy this. <laughs> oh, and I then, thought, I did think when this was happening, this whole, like, uh, the friend that, who was more than a friend once, at one point in time, I thought you would find this whole situation very uh, uncomfortable. That's oh, why he I left. I wasn't even taking, I wasn't taking that to heart anymore, because my next note was, my God, it's only been 12 more minutes, I'm in hell. <laughs> <laughs> but, but then you decided, I'm gonna take a shower. Let's just take a shower. I, you mind if I watch you shower? These people are freaks. So it's weird. I'm like, oh, now I understand what's happening. He wants to make sure that his brides get along. He's making some. He's making. He's doing Dracula's brides. That oh, must be what's to be happening. A full Dracula. Yeah, mm. there's. But gonna he's be, not. Well, uh, he should have stopped because he already had t- two other ones. He had prostitute no wig, and he had baby mama prostitute. There's, you, that's it. You're good. Well, people also, never this tell lady me is off when I get tall. out of the shower. Yeah, she is. That, does that I just that just jumped out at me? Does that intrigue reasons. you? They very it intriguing. Was, yes, it wasn't me. Caught me red-handed banging on the bathroom floor. <laughs> Picture this: she was choking me harder. How did she just kill like her? Just like I asked her for uh, consensual. I like it. How did? Oh, yeah, she Why, choked start, her to she, death. She, she, she strangles her. That's right. She chokes her. Yeah, she did what she asked, and she's like, "Whoops." I'm like, "Whoop!" Makes some more space in the is, freezer. You know, the doctor's over there, like, taking a massive shit during this whole thing. Just Where did he go? Did he say side. that he was going to go do something? He's probably he left off them alone eating for another a prostitute. While. He had to go to town. But this is your childhood friend. Yeah. Yeah, slash That, that slam you've piece. now left alone with your... He's got a line on a prostitute that's running in an orphanage, and he's like, what better place to go eat somebody? Bunch of it's Capri a buffet. He, he opens the ba- a bathroom door, and he's like, oh, did shit, not. early dinner. That's rude. Ooh, sharing just, a meal. Like, he just... Gets down and they're like fucking cats licking the shit off the floor. I'm like, just stop it, guys. Just stop it. And then <laughs> just she stop gets it. up. Yep, but no one's out to spray them, so they don't. Yeah, right? So she wakes would have sprayed them. Oh, he would have sprayed them hard. He would have spayed them, too. Probably should have. Yeah. And they're like, well, okay, she's alive. Like, nah, she ain't alive. Let's bury her. So, like, they just go. I was like, no, clearly she's up. Like, you're going to bury her? But now my man has been immortal for maybe six months. And now he's tired of existing. And I'm like, yeah. same, bro. Well, it's so, yeah, I don't know why they bury her, but okay, that's fine. But he goes, he checks on mama and baby, and we find out pretty, she's eating baby. And I guess, but this is where the movie wakes up because we have a nice little musical break. We're back to the church. You got to learn to let it go. Okay. Let it go. At least you got to learn minutes. when it's all over. Oh, easily 10. John and Baptiste. he's still not participating. Should have been the mantra for the editing, but what could you do? <laughs> He doesn't get Zinger. into the church stuff until the reverend does a head shove, a head push. Oh, like the leg you know, of where hands? You push the head yeah, yeah, down. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. You don't do that. They they do a head push there. Oh, but we don't like get, head pushers. Yeah, we don't like. But he, I guess he's feeling it now. But then he didn't even stay for the encore, and that little kid singer was like getting it. That's because he was getting hungry and he thought he'd eat him. Yeah, uh, we've all been there. So vampires can walk in the day. Yeah, they can. But also, I feel like if I go to Central Park and take binoculars and look up at any of those buildings around there, I'm probably going to see someone standing in the window with their wang out. I don't know where he was for sure, but that looked like a Central Park type setup with buildings around a park. And he's just standing there bare ass naked at the window. So I get is it Martha's Vit? There's a house at Martha. Martha's Vineyard. He's got houses everywhere. And he's then got he a has house an at Martha's Vineyard. Uh, uh, Martha, save us, Martha. I'm the one who takes the bones. Now, I think if Mothra knew what he was up to, he would not be allowed to hang out at Mothra's Vineyard yeah, anymore. Mothra would not be a fan. <laughs> uh, Hi. Well, I like you. Look, <laughs> I like Ray, you. Ray, I like you. Raimi comes out all like sassy in his sassy pajamas. Does he live there? And, yeah. yeah what is he living, in pajamas? He's, he's living he's, hell. But he, he, he gets sent home at some points in the movie, so... But well, doesn't he, live probably there. A, a the lady of the house of the is here now, Daniel, and she set special rules, like having the help be available. So if this bitch wants pickles at 3 a.m., I gotta be awake? Yep. If you gotta give her the pickle. To open the thing of pickles? Is what? that what she wanted? I don't know. He's leaning into the fridge to get to find the thing for her, and the knife block is right behind him. I go, I don't like that knife block behind him, and literally half a second... Here I it's thought they back. had like, finally oh. they had finally made like a nice little truce. She was like, "I'm sorry, I've been been so mean to you." And he's like, "Okay, you know what? I'm gonna find this thing for you." And then she stabs him in the back. Yeah. You know, the thing is, they had made it come to a, an agreement, Daniel. But 
the doc is in there having his little existential crisis, so he's no longer providing. And no one's ever actually talked to Seneschal about providing for them their actual needs. He's like, I ain't into that. Look, I'll stick around here. I'll make real food, all that stuff, but I ain't gonna be out there getting well, you prostitutes. they eat real food. My mom was a prostitute. Yeah, but they need more than, you know, that. I, I do, so, too. I thought she stabbed him for, Sons. for taking so long to wake up and hearing her in the kitchen and coming out to help her. I thought that's why she yeah, stabbed maybe. him. Also, he clearly did not go to the Christopher Lee school of getting stabbed in the back. No, he makes so much noise. Mm, so much noise. I hate her so much. He was the only other character I gave a damn about. <laughs> and it's like, she goes walking in there. She goes, Hess, I killed the dude who keeps our secrets to take care of us. You happy? <laughs> I, I killed the only one who works for us. Good luck, Hess. Yeah. <laughs> And then Hess is, Hess is like, I done found God, I guess. So, yeah, you, you know, see this cross break no more. hanging from the ceiling with the shadow you know of Jesus on me? know how long it took me to line this up? You Not very long. know how long I've been in here tinkering I, around I had, with this? I had Seneschal do it. <laughs> Before now, he went to get you gonna... a snack. And you know what? I was going to come have back, come have him come back in to move it like an inch to the left. I've been calling for him. He's not. Have you seen him? I'm so mad. I want him back. I'm probably going to fire him. She's not into it, though. She doesn't want to sit there and just die like him. But she's going to die anyway without Seneschal, so whatever. And right here was another great chance for the walk of life to play in this movie. After he dies, and she's like, well, I'm going to go, like, you know, keep living. She goes down to the beach in her nice, empowering black dress. And uh, zombie tall chick is back, just walking around. Tangier, zombie friend. Totally naked. Yeah. She dug herself out. And I'm like, okay, how much was she feeding around there? And then the credits came up. And Daniel, can you guess what I said when the credits came up? Thank God. Uh, no, I said fucking finally. <laughs> <laughs> nice alliteration. I, Thank you. And then I went and listened to The Walk of Life, which immediately improved my mood. Hey, Daniel, did you like this movie? No. Huh? I would even... I, I'm tempted. It, no, it's not. To, I'm tempted no, to say not, it is. it's not, Daniel. I'm tempted to say it is. It is not worse than The Outwaters. I'm tempted to say it is, though. Which one is longer? Mm. This could be season two's Outwaters. I will agree to that, but I won't agree that this movie is worse. Because I think, like, Outwaters had ideas. I did not care about any of the characters in Outwaters. This Here you one, got Hennishal. You're right. You're I got right. Hennishal. <laughs> I like Dr. Green initially. I really like Ganja initially. It's just when they... There were... Inconsistent character turns that made no sense. Then I didn't like them. Yeah, there were actually parts in this that I was like, okay, okay. So this wins. Outwaters had no Outwaters single got, part. Outwaters has, has uh, tentacles, uh, intestine worms. It, it has Plus. tunnel snakes. Yes, Daniel, I know. I know. It has You know little... how much it pains him to not love that? Yeah. I mean, I, I can... I can see the little barbarian baby running around in the background. I see it, Daniel. I see it. And I still cannot say that Outwaters is better than this. Outwaters was an original experiment, thought, movie. This is a boring remake. A shot, a boring shot for shot remake of uh, what I guess many people consider a, a classic, I guess, right? Or at least a very important movie. Like, if you haven't seen Ganja and Hess, you've at least maybe even heard of Ganja and Hess. So it has like a, it's in the zeitgeist. I this, yeah. well, you okay. can't even get in an age of digital media. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that Ganja and, like and Hess had been remade and I saw the direct, I saw the name Spike Lee and I went. Ten years old. Okay. Is this a so ten year that's old why thought? I went with this one <laughs> and not the not Ganja and Hess. I'm like, Spike Lee? Okay. It's going to be. A modern update or or something. No, it won't. It's going to be something. I'm I'm I don't think shot for shot remakes where you keep everything. This, I mean, I don't know because I haven't seen the original, but Psycho. Did you see the uh, when they did it with Psycho? No. Yeah, of course not. Omen because there was no was reason really to good. do it. That's what I'm saying. Why would you do that? Because sometimes you just want updated like you want to do it with no. better no. equipment. No, the That's Omen dumb. worked really well. There's nothing wrong with the Omen. Oh, I love the original, but I love the remake, too. It's great. Oh. What's your... I don't like this movie. Spike... Yeah, no, it's not good. What's your favorite Spike Lee directed movie, though? I've only seen this and Black Klansman, so... <laughs> I'm going right? Black Klansman. Black Klansman is a, is a good ding, movie. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, Spike Lee done Was... any other horror movies? I mean, the horrors of Black Life. I mean, oh, Documentaries, yeah. Documentaries, right? I mean, oh, I forget he did Malcolm X. Yeah, he did Malcolm X. I guess I've seen that, too. Yeah. Yeah. School Days is a classic. He's got some bangers, right? But does he have 
recent bangers? The Black Klansman was 2018. Yeah, I guess you're. And that was pretty damn good. I don't. If there's a, if he did another genre like horror genre movie, I don't know what it is. And here's the thing: this is not a horror movie. It's barely a movie. This is more like yeah. It's more like um. People were describing the the reviews were describing these scenes as so shocking and horrifying. Were they talking about the the licking of the blood off the about? floor? Wait, 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 wait. Did either of you watch the old boy remake that he did? God, no. No. Yeah, I didn't either. I Why would I do that, that to him. myself? But I've heard that it's utter trash. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing wrong with old boy, so I don't need to, well. I think you could do an American remake, I'd, but I don't know. Oh, and they do, Daniel. They do. Well, this got a 4.5. His old boy got a 5.8. How much did Shark's Side of the Moon get? Was that a two? It's like two through two point seven, I bet. Three point two. Now, Kenny, I want you to look at us and tell us that this is better than Shark Side of the Moon. Oh, I won't lie to you. This ain't better than Shark Side. Oh, Shark Side redeemed. Every movie we watch is further <laughs> affirmation that we did Shark Side dirty or maybe maybe Kenny did Shark Side. Kenny what, did what Dark Shi- Shark Side dirty. We don't talk about Shark Side you enough in season Dark two. Sh- dark Shide. <laughs> dark I've had dirty. a dark shot a dark shider. I've had a dark shite. I've had a dark side of our day, day, day. The sweet day, blood day, of day, dark cider is coming up. Now, the sweet blood of Jesus, that's wine, right? I don't know. Is he drunk all the time? What's his blood alcohol level? What a, you drink a little, you have to spit it out because all the black pepper. I hate when they put so much black pepper in mine. I wish he would have spit it onto her and not the bush. Right in that face. Yeah, that would be right funny. And then she opened her Immediately. mouth and she's like, Immediately. Yes. Just bleh. I wish a lot Ryan, of things. Ryan, did you like this movie? No. Because our conversation last night made Daniel and I maybe think a little bit that you yeah, did. Yeah, you was trolling. Oh, Daniel knows me too well. I'm tro- I'm tro- Here's the thing. I got guilt, but I made us watch this, and I white had to guilt? think of something. White- yep. Oh, Yo, I thought oh, you were going to say you had white it. guilt, so you didn't want to, like, <laughs> trash the movie. <laughs> what? Oh, no, 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 no. This thing is... I don't know what to say about this thing. It's... I, I think don't, there's a reason you can't find it easily. I don't get it. For such a modern movie, even though it's 10 years old this year... The fact that you can't just pop on Amazon and buy it digitally is insane. That was crazy to me. I would have given Spike Lee like four dollars to rent this. Oh uh, well, he, I, would, I would have been mad about it at the end. I would have but given I gave him it to him twenty dollars to edit it. <laughs> I would have if I, I had, if I had known I would have edited it. Okay. Okay, but he 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 just wanted to remake uh, one of his favorite movies. Spider-Man. And he, Spider-Man. Yeah, Spider-Man. And he failed. Because there's is, no Spider-Man This is the in worst this. Spider-Man <laughs> no movie. Spider-Man at all. We can all agree on that. This is a Punch me, Spider-Man rankings. This that. is the bottom. <laughs> this is the worst this Spider-Man movie. This is the bathroom fo- floor of blood Spider-Man movie, okay? Just the worst. Do you think that baby's going to grow up? Or do you think they... Because we don't know if they the aging process nah, starts. It's, you think it's, it's just a great father? Baby. I think that baby's oh. screwed. We just got to starve it and then it'll die. Go watch Grace. Grace is good. Grace is an art house movie, but not boring. That, yeah, but not boring. Go I'm watch here She Never to Died. Once again, say Thirst is actually, I think, doing what this movie attempted to do, only good. Thirst is good. Thirst is probably my favorite vampire movie, period. So should, no, should we have wrong. just have it's, watched it's Vampire in Brooklyn? That came no, out you want a the year black- before this. That's a fun fact. Well, a year before the original. Oh, but before oh. Gajan Hess. If you want the quintessential black vampire movie, it's Vampire in Brooklyn with Eddie Murphy. I, that movie's I so guess. serious, though. Why is so it's great. serious? Great. Good time. Blade? I was going to think, what, what uh, happened to Blade? Oh, he there. kills vampires. We don't like that. Well, at the start of that movie, I'm not sure any of those people were vampires. I think Wesley Snipes just wandered into a goth bar and... Uh, <laughs> and he's like, you guys freaked me out! You freaks! <laughs> Take out <laughs> Oh, no, he's like, are you with the IRS? And he just starts slashing through people. Ha! Yeah. yeah. I fucking hate taxes. I hate... Oh, uh, Halle Berry, punching in the side of the head. Wait, oh. I thought, there were, I thought you were saying there was a movie... That uh, that Halle Berry was in a Blade movie and that Blade punched her in the side of the head. No, instead it was real life when Wesley Snipes punched her in the side of the head. Also, I guess you could, um, that's another thing, uh, Deadly Premonition. No vampires, but it is a way better time. This is true. Mortal Kombat. Which one, the new one? Sure. Just any of them? <laughs> no. Hmm. It's got Jax. Okay, <laughs> vampire, vampire couple He gets movies. his arms ripped off. Name another vampire couple And then he gets, and then he gets robot arms. 
Another vampire, vampire couple, couple. Thirst. Okay. Besides that, Twix. Thirst two. The the thirstening. <laughs> Bra- Bram Stoker's Dracula. Um, no. Uh, no. What's the, interview uh, with a vampire? Yeah, interview with the vampire Lestat and the other one. Louis. True Blood. Slight no, upward curve. Blood. I think that's getting rebooted or some shit. It's only been five or ten years, so yeah, it's time to do it again. I think there was an interview with the Vampire TV series that was probably bad Uh, recently. I think it's still going on, actually. And they are doing her uh, her witch books, too, I think. She's like a super Christian now. Aren't we all? Too much hot... Hard pivot. Too much hot dude vampire boning. She couldn't handle it. She got, I made this too hot. It's too hot. I gotta back away. Back away. Back away. Back away. Back away. Uh, Frankenfish. What's, uh, 30 days a night? Oh, Ooh, we just know vampire movie. movies now? <laughs> no, I'm just throwing out movies. <laughs> Dracula 3000. No, shut that's up. That's the one in space. Has right. uh, has yeah. Coolio in it. Okay, um, let's do Dario Gento's Dracula. Bam. That's not. <laughs> then he turn into a mantis? Don't we all? That's what Horror Etc. told me. I haven't actually seen Is it. Is it not true? Oh, you haven't seen it? I've seen it, but it's been a bit. I remember the purple lightning. Um, I remember the busty vampire ladies. They were fun. Let Everybody the right likes one them. In. Oh yeah, there you go. Let the right one in, Ryan. There's your there's your couple, except there's only one vampire. No. Oh, that's true. But it is there is they are a couple. Yeah. Yeah. A couple yeah, yeah. of freaks. Couple of dudes. Well, yeah. I read uh, that. What book. we do in the shadows. Book. What we do in the shadows? Yeah. You don't want to know what I do in the shadows. What's that Puppets. shitty vampire one with Adrian Paul? Uh, oh. Um What's that one with oh, hold uh, on. I want I almost said John Cena, but that's not it. John Cena? <laughs> that's not it. The uh, the name his name is Tao. Uh, that's oh, that's fuck. not the Jean-Claude. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that's the Breed. Ken, you're thinking of The Breed. The Breed. That movie sucked. I have it on DVD. I wanted to like it because, you know, Adrian Paul. We uh, all like the one Adrian with Steven Paul. Seagal sucked because, well, Steven Seagal, he says one word in that whole movie when they go, what's your name? Tao. I remember we watched it. I don't remember anything about it. Just him saying... Tao. He went from like all those years trying to get people to think he was what Native American to now all these years wanting people to think he's Asian. Yep. In reality, he just wants to touch your feet and keep you in his basement. Keep you in his basement. Allegedly, his favorite his favorite movie was uh, House Arrest, where the kids lock their parents up in the basement and like they do it all. I like the Money Pit. No, that's a good movie. The Burbs. Oh, you know what? You know what? Fright Night. Fright Night's a banger. The remake. So the good. remake's really good too, yeah. The sequel to the first one, pretty good. The sequel to the remake, it's not good. Did did they call it Fright Nights? No, it's part two. Oh. Is there Yeah, they made a sequel to the remake as well, and it's not good. It probably doesn't have the ca- the, the call in it, does it? Well, no. So then how, Dan- how, how could it be good? Dead. How could it and be? And An- Anton's not in it either. He's dead too, literally. Uh, I don't know if he was at the time of its release, so. There's lots of vampire movies. Twilight. Twilight's better than this. Oh yeah, easily. That's not even a. That's not even a question. Ryan did this to us. That's fair. I I have stabbed us all with the Ashanti dagger. I was gonna ask why did we watch this? Because Ryan wanted us to get us a hot start to Black History Month by shitting on a black director. I a well-renowned, a very popular, well-renowned black director. Way to go, Ryan. <laughs> Way to go, Ryan. You ruined Black History Month. Hey. Pam Greer is in Scream, Blackula Scream. We should have watched that. Well, too late now. We already did this, and it has to go out because you made us watch it. I'll be More damned if nothing comes out of it. More importantly, you made us record it. Well, <laughs> what are we watching next? What are we reviewing next? We are reviewing... We are reviewing The Good House. By? By, I believe it's uh, Tenen Arive Du. Yeah, she's great. So... Read up on that. Have fun. Yeah. Well, 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 as always, I've been your horrible host, Kenny, saying it wasn't me. <laughs> Take your time. <laughs> uh, um, uh, I have performance anxiety. Uh, um, um, I've been your friend or i guess actually your research assistant that you invite over to your house and then i climb a tree and then i try to kill myself with your rope in your tree in your white neighborhood 
Daniel. This ain't your tree, okay? It was his tree. Yeah, it's the world's tree. Oh, he tree. was saying he it said, was like, blah, 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 who cares, yeah. Yeah. Daniel. <laughs> Why'd that man reel my mommy? Ryan. <laughs> the baby Ryan. That's the baby's uh, fucking villain origin story. The baby's blade. The baby is the blade. Baby he watched his blade. <laughs> He watched he Mama's Way cut mom. right off. No, that's a, that was a different lady. Mm. It wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs>